The boycott of Japanese goods has continued for half a year since Japan removed Korea from its white list of preferred trading partners in July this year. As the number of Koreans visiting the island country has been dropping, the air routes connecting the two countries are less frequently used. Mike Balfour reports. Jeju Air will suspend flying between Jeju and Fukuoka beginning next month. The flight has been operating for just five months. The route was opened in July this year. Anti-Japanese sentiment has led to a boycott of Japanese goods, resulting in lower seat occupancy. Levels have gone down to 30 percent, an intolerable deficit for the airline. The air routes between the two countries have been less frequently used since Japan's export restriction to Korea. The number of passengers in November dropped 50 percent, compared with the same period last year. The number of flights connecting Jeju and the island country are shrinking. Only three routes are currently in service. Flights between Jeju and Fukuoka will be suspended next year. Then the island will have only two routes servicing Japan. Furthermore, airlines have cut the number of flights on the two routes. If relations between Korea and Japan don't improve and the seat occupancy rate continues to drop, further reduction of flights is expected. The continuing anti-Japanese boycott is dramatically affecting business between Korea and the island country. Mike Balfour, KCTV.